Hi everyone, today we have uh, our Agra C20P. We will do our first test flights of the new later drone. We have now the drone, the remote controller, and the full Boba battery is ready. We also got the water to test the spray system. Let's see the performance together with, with us. Now the, our drone landed here, we will unfold our propeller or the M and we put the battery and put the water. So everything is ready with drone, so we will put the water now. Now everything is ready, so we will go and check our remote controller if any error to do test flights. As it plus, go with the mode. Whatever your mode, spray system is on. Real time data should be on. Okay, and the aircrafts, RDH attitude is quite less. We cannot take off from here because it's very close to the other objects. The radar says you cannot take off, so we need to move. Okay, uh, okay, we were flying this side. Okay, okay. Huh? It's okay. Yeah. Okay, good. Obstacle above aircraft. Okay. Fly with caution. So. No, okay. Okay, now everything is fine. We have. Uh, we can see here. The satellites. Signal is round 28. Remote controller, the battery 100%. The, the liquid is 15 port in size. Yeah. Everything fine. The spray system, we need to click. See, we need to calibrate flow meter because the first time you need to calibrate your spray system. C20P or Agra zone, you need to do this calibration basically. Just click. It's simple stuff. When you buy the new Agra zone, First thing for your spray system, you need to calibrate your flow meter. Okay, just wait some time, then finish. Just click, release the air, press two second the spray button. You will increase now five meter per, five liter per minute. Six liter per minute. 7, 10, 11. So now I'm testing the flow rate. Okay. So as we already expected, with this year we go for 12 liter per minute flow rate. Even T13 can do that. Okay. So now we go for T20P, 12 liter per minute. The flow rate is high, and we can also adjust the, uh, the drop less. Same like uh, Agra T14. So you get the later feature in Agra T20P. Now we will check the the performance. The, the yaw, the stick, how it's smooth. Let's see together. Very close, uh, I, I am, and it doesn't allow me to fly because okay. it's very close to drone. So what will do? Be uh, always more than the six meter away from the drone. Okay, there we go now. Stand back at a safe distance. Take off.
Now I did some flies, I checked the flow rate. As you see, the battery stay 84%. All the 16 liter is already done. And uh, it's very quite, it's quite smooth when I make a 10 round. And because also the latex firmware uh, recently we introduced, so there's also non-spray area. That means it will save a lot of your time to finish your, your farm. It's not like before. It's uh, 12 liter per minute and uh, droplet side uh, ranges. You can always adjust it depending on the different kind of chemical. You will get more flight time if you go with uh, D14 or D13 battery or all other accessory. They are compatible with each other. Um, see the stability? It's quite strong. Now we have some wind here, it's blowing. But say the drone can resist very well. And when I push the move, see I put the information is quite smooth. Let's try friend. I will break. She is very smooth there. When it stop, check the drone. I will release. Uh, see back at the backward. I show you. When I release. I will release. See, it's very quite responsive and very smooth. So it will make you to the accuracy at the uh, tiny points on your farm. Yeah, brilliant. I'm sure you will, that it will meet your expectation with your budget and uh, later feature. Work efficiency, very impressive. If you have T13 or T14, you can share the battery together. Thanks uh, for watching our video. And if you still have uh, more questions about uh, our Agra C20P, leave a comment below and subscribe for more video. For me, I still need to, uh, I still want to fly because it's still a lot of battery. I can stay fly for a long time. Bye bye. See you in the next video.